Hey guys, here we are with five alphabet games. Welcome to Andy, the ESL guy. Let's get straight into game number one. This one is called Letters in Your Name. Okay guys, so for this game, you want to set your board up like this. So here we have in happy face, not in sad face. Same over here. Now I've chosen 10 random letters for this side and for this side. If you don't have these magnets, don't worry, just um, use something similar to this. You can even just write the letters yourself, put some magnets on the back. Two students come up, ask their name. So a classic English boy's name in China, Superman. What's your name? It's Flower. Okay, so here's Flower. So explain to the students, if the letter is in your name, it goes here. If it's not in your name, it goes here. Are you ready? Let's go. Three, two, one. Go. So Superman checks out. He's got a U. He's got a U. He has an S. What else? He's got a P. There's a P. And he R, R, R. There's an R. Okay. He doesn't have D. There's no H. There's no D. Boom. Boom. There is an A. There is an A. Okay. Now, after you've done this, you can have them. What I like to do is say the letters they have in their name. A S U R P. Run and sit down. Who's the fastest? Who does it correctly is the winner. Some are curvy. Some are straight. And we know how it goes. Some are curvy and straight. So say your board up like this. We have the, the curvy letters. Straight line letters. Both. Both on each side. Okay, so I like to have this as a writing game. Even if the students are very young, it's still fun for them to, to write on the board. Choose three letters, okay? So here I write in the bottom, go for S, capital A, and here's a small D, okay? So the students then, one student here, one student here, three, two, one, Go! So they have to write the letter. So S. S is curvy. So I'm thinking S goes here, yeah? S. A. Don't, don't, don't. Straight lines, straight lines. A. Yes. D. Uh, D. Uh, I'm thinking here. D. Straight line. Up, down. Five. Run. Sit down. Have them say the letters. S. A. D. Weirdly spells sat. I didn't mean that. <laughs> anyway. But uh, good game guys, good practice for the students and good fun as always. So let's take a look at game number three. This one guys we call alphabet tic-tac-toe. So instead of using your usual knots and crosses, split your class into two teams and allow each team to choose a letter. So here for example this team chooses U. These guys go for F. Okay. So how to play, choose one student from this team. Maybe you can paper, scissors, stone, see who goes first. Okay, so one student from this team is team U. They come up, write the U. Okay, one student from this team, F. Keep going. Another student from this team comes here, goes for a U. This team, Go F, so you get the idea. Practicing writing the letters until obviously you have three in a row. Bingo! This game, guys, takes a little bit of pre-preparation. So what you need to do is stick some letters onto your dice, okay? So here we've got lowercase letters, A, B, C, D, E, F. On the board, so two teams, we have Team Shark, Team Butterfly Man, capital letters here and here, okay? So this team can throw the dice. So they throw a 
C, okay? So all you do is, underneath the C, write the small C. So make sure the whole team says letter C. Good job. Team Butterfly Man can throw, choose one student, throw the dice. What do we have? Small B, good job. So small B goes here, okay. So keep playing the game. The first team to have every letter is the winner. Okay, now let's have a look at game number five. So for this game, you'll need a digital touch screen in your class and log into abcat.com. So as you can see here, it shows all the different levels for games. So you can scroll down, learning letters. Here's a list of different alphabet games. You can go down to here, language arts. And as you can see, many different games, guys. So these, I find these are great for the young kids. So we'll take a look at one of the games, Adventure Man Dungeon Dash. So let's take a look here. Play. Okay, go for Adventure Man. Choose your challenge. So we'll go for uppercase letters. Okay, so the idea of this game is to only go through the door with the uppercase letter, okay? So I'll... S Let me see here... Okay, so we have Q, go down, go down, into M. Okay, happy days. So keep playing through the game until the end. Now, as I say, this website has many different games you can try out with your students. So, hope you enjoyed the video guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers!